Unfortunately, we have been on this road talking to contractors. And the truth is that nobody will understand what we have passed in the hands of contractors. But contractors, instead of doing their works, they go up and down lobbying stakeholders in the nation to put pressure on Minister of Works. We've demonstrated our courage and capacity to terminate any job that the contractor is playing tricks. And so we use the opportunity to warn CCCC. Out of 25 kilometers, you've just completed 2.5 kilometer double carriageway and 4.5 on single. That is very terrible. You talk to them, they say it's because of compensation. Our dear governor has since settled the compensation issue. And so we're giving the marching order to mobilize to at least three sections of that road. Mr. President has given enough money to fund the project. The same thing with Julius Beja. Samatek is an indigenous contractor. Today he has the equipment we desire that high-tech is using to lay concrete on the road. It's a local contractor, but go there and see what he has done. He has started using that machine to lay the concrete road because it's the concrete that can that is sustainable on that road. There's no amount of asphalt you will put on that road that it will last. And so, by the end of this coming week, if Julio Beja fails to remobilize to site and CCCC fails to get mobilized in at least three sections, the jobs will be terminated following due process. We will do that.